popular breakfast and lunch spot. You know it for breakfast and lunch in La Jolla, but now they're kicking off these monthly pop-up series, and the first one is happening on Friday. Joining us now, Chef Paolo and manager Trevor LaCour from the cottage. I've been there. You guys do breakfast and lunch. What are you doing to a dinner now? <laughs> good morning to both of you. Good morning. Good Thank morning. you for being here. Yeah. You're doing this for a reason. Uh, you're using this to be able to highlight different things and uh, you know cultures in the community. The first one that's happening is celebrating Asian American and Pacific Islander Heritage Month. That's personal to you, Chef. Yes, ma'am. Why? It's, well, just because it's my culture, my blood. It's um. Yeah, it's um, and it's um, Asian Heritage Month. Yeah, we're a couple of Filipino Americans. Yeah. Filipino, I love yeah. Filipino, <laughs> and you're gonna bring that food and flavor. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Uh, in into the pop up. So, chef, what are you gonna make? What is this called today? Oh, this is called a banh mi. Banh mi. I know what it's the banh mi is. Yeah, it's a Vietnamese sandwich. Oh, it's really so popular. Good. It's so good. We got I mean, it two ways. Sorry, go yeah, ahead. No, what do you make it with? You can do it with mushrooms or... We can or... do it with mushrooms or we're doing it with um, pork belly right here. Okay. Traditionally, it's made out of like pig's face. Oh, but hello, no, chef. We are not. <laughs> Don't good worry, morning, we're not making chef. that for you. <laughs> it's the finest cuts of pork. So we are not doing that today. It's a pork sisig banh mi. So it's okay. a fusion of a Filipino and a uh, Vietnamese dish. I yeah. think most people at this point have tried a banh mi. Totally. Like, you know what that is. It's Maybe that not meat. pork sisig as much, though. You know, that's a more traditional yeah. Filipino street food. So, chef, why don't you get started and yes, you can put that together. We can watch all of that happen. While Trevor, you can talk to me a little bit about, you know, the cottage. Yes. Most people People, you know the banh mi, you know right. the cottage only does breakfast and, and lunch. These pop-up dinners are pretty special. Yeah, you might not recognize any of this stuff. So no. we're known for French toast, eggs, benedict, granola, that's what put us on the map, right? Yep. So we're trying something new uh, for the next three months. We're gonna be doing a summer dinner series. So okay. we're hosting these dinners one night only, once a month. Okay. Right, so we've got upcoming, we've got a kind of a wine pairing dinner. We're, we have one we're preparing uh, with a local butcher to kind of highlight local meats. But this month, because of American Asian Pacific Islander Heritage Month, we are doing a pan Asian prefix Ooh. menu. It's eight courses. Eight courses? Yeah, it's, so bring your appetite. It's $85 <laughs> per person. So we still have a few tickets left. Okay. CottageLaHoya.com if you want to check that out. It, um, part of the proceeds goes to a great cause. It's the San Diego Asian Pacific Islander Coalition. Mm -hmm. So this is a group of people who are, um, they're giving us Asian Pacific Islanders, Polynesians, a voice in San Diego. Okay. Something that hasn't really been at the forefront for a long time, but yeah. thanks to them and a few other really great folks, um, yeah, we're, we're getting a voice in the community. So when you talk about the eight cores, I see some really yummy food. I can't wait yeah. till the sandwich is done, but are these some of the things that you guys are serving? You Bingo. come up with a menu that's yeah. you know, true to the to the culture? So this is our mousse bouche right here. We've this got a uh, ahi pokey and seared steak duo okay. in a sesame shoyu sauce. Okay. This is a pork adobo um, musubi. Traditionally made with spam, but I mean that adobo is super good. Is it Try good? some of that okay. later. Yeah, it's fantastic. And then, this? and then this one is gonna be a seaweed pesto udon Ooh. with a seared ahi. That one's my personal favorite. I mean super good. Yeah. We're all fighting over your face. The camera's not on us, <laughs> yeah. and then behind the camera he's like, that's mine. I'm like, no, 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 no that's mine. There's enough for everybody, don't worry. Okay, but it could be yours if you wanna go yes. to uh, cottagelahoya.com. Check it okay. out, okay? So you buy a ticket for $85, right. and then you're there for how long? What time you're is there it? You're there for, you know, hour and a half, couple hours, it's an eight course meal. So like I said, bring your appetite. Wow. You know, it's not gonna be too much food. It's perfectly portioned. Okay. It's gonna fill you up, but not too much. And a tarot creme brulee right at the end. Mm. Okay, let me give you the ticket information. So if you'd like to go and you wanna like fight over the food the way we are here, it's happening on Friday. It's at the Cottage of La Jolla. It's a very special event, just a pop-up event. And all um, and this is benefiting the San Diego Asian Pacific Islander Coalition. Tickets are $85. And you can get more information uh, on our website, fox5sandiego.com. You click the little C, non-tab. Chef is plating the sandwich. Ooh. Smells so good. <laughs> I know, it's so good. He has to finish that. And I, I claim the noodles, and nothing anybody can do about it. Yeah, so the great thing is, when I'm on air, I get dibs. So we are going to take a break. Make sure you get your tickets, because there's not many left. I'll share that sandwich with somebody. Yummy. Chef, thank you for being here. Thank you for being here, guys. Of course. Chef Paolo, he's a master. Thank he you. is a master. We'll be right back.